I'm back. Every time I say that, I think, I'm back in the saddle again. I'm back. You know, Aerosmith. But then I also think, I'm back in the saddle again. Back where a friend was a friend. I don't know how that goes. My husband used to sing that all the time. We're from two different generations. So I'm singing Aerosmith's Back in the Saddle Again, and he's singing Gene Autry's Back in the Saddle Again. <laughs> it's too funny. Well, he's not anymore, but he did. Anyway, that's silly. I don't know. But every time I say, I'm back, I just think of Aerosmith. And then immediately I think of my husband, who used to always sing the Gene Autry song when he would say he was back. So I guess, I guess we're both right. <laughs> anyway, today I was having major 80s nostalgia. I wanted to go back to the 80s today. I literally wanted to step back in time and go back to my, back to my 80s roots. Seriously, I started watching this channel on YouTube and it's got 80s mute, well, it has a bunch of 80s stuff, but it has like 80s cartoons and, but I'm not really interested in the cartoons. I was too, I was too much of a teenager at that point, but 80s music, but in between the video music, the videos, there's commercials, commercials from back in the day. And I had forgotten about lots of stuff, you guys. It's crazy. The, the styles, the candies commercials. I don't know if you guys remember candies. I always wanted a pair of those big FM pumps. Yeah, the slip-ons like Olivia Newton-John wore. I wanted those, but I could never walk in heels. So, oh well. Um, not very well, not big tall hills like that, but they had an agree, agree shampoo commercial. Oh, I used to love that shampoo so much. And then do you guys remember when Finesse came out and it smelled so good? Um, before those, before agree, before Finesse, there was gee, your hair smells terrific. <laughs> I wanted my mom to buy me that all the time. We would go to my cousin's house and my cousin, um, I have their sisters. One is a little bit older than me. And then one is just six weeks older than me. Six weeks. Yeah. Six weeks. Her birthday's in her birthday's in one month. And then six weeks later is mine. Anyway, I was Mimi and she was Coco. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, I forgot what the point, oh, the point was we would go to visit them and they always had that perfume. Gee, your hair smells terrific. And I wanted it. It smelled so good. And I always wanted my mom to buy it, but she said it was too expensive, you know, too expensive for a kid that's using tons, way more shampoo than they probably need and then needs the conditioner, you know, anyway, I just remember it pert. I remember all the shampoos that I liked because they smelled so good. But anyway, so today I kind of did an 80s hairdo and I did an 80s eye look with the blue eyeliner, <laughs> the shiny lips. I would have put my favorite lipstick from the 80s, but they don't make it anymore. It was the L'Oreal Seafloor. I love that stuff. But anyway, I could not for the life of me remember how I used to do my eyeshadow back in the day. I do remember I wore a lot of blue eyeliner. I even wore blue mascara sometimes, I guess. Anyway, so today I, wa I was feeling nostalgic. I wanted to step back into the 80s and it didn't really work out the way that I had hoped kind of hoped I would have stepped through a time portal and went back to the 80s with the knowledge that I have now. <laughs> and man, I would be living it up back then. <laughs> Silly, I know. But anyway, I had a fun day. I had a fun day just kicking back, 
um, living, living back in my youth, thinking about things from my youth and wishing I could do some things over again, you know, like really appreciate those times because man, I don't want to get all sentimental, but man, when you get old, you think I've got way less life in front of me than I do behind me. Ugh, stupid, I know. Sorry, I didn't mean to get all emotional. That's so silly. That's so silly. Make sure I don't have lipstick on my teeth. Okay. Anyway, I have... <laughs> I can't get my shit together, sorry. I have um, a couple small Timu hauls for you to do today. Um, I saved the one because it seemed kind of small and then the next order I got is really small too. So I have two small orders. I'll try to stretch them out because I know you guys like the long hauls. Oh, if you're new here, thank you for coming and watching my channel. If you're coming back, I so appreciate you guys. I love your comments. Um, I love all the ones that always comment and send, send, say such nice things. One lady said she loved my eyebrows. I was like, yes, girl, because I hate my eyebrows. They are the bane of my existence. <laughs> I have to work so hard to get them. So when somebody said they loved the way my eyebrows looked, I was like, thank you, Jesus. Oh, anyway, I'm feeling silly tonight. Sorry, I think I'm kind of tired now that I've been goofing off all day, didn't do anything. I did want to get this done and hopefully get some more stuff done. I did, I got my, I dyed my hair today I was trying to do a short to show, remember that ad, I'm gonna wash that gray right out of my hair. I'm gonna wash that gray right out of my hair. And then she does and she comes walking down the street and she says, I washed that gray right out of my hair and her hair was all done. I was gonna try to do a short kind of like that. And I put the, I had the, 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 the basket, not the basket, the plastic thing on my head, you know, when I was, had the hair dye on and I put the, and I tied it down here and I, I took a picture and then I was going to try to like, um, superimpose a picture of my hair all done and everything with the, with the gray all out and everything with that song. And I found the song through YouTube, so I thought I could use it, but I couldn't figure out how to do a short, so that went in the trash. I started it and then restarted it and restarted it, but I couldn't figure it out, so whatever. But I did dye my hair. I got rid of those grays. Man, when I did the, um, when I did the get ready with me and I was sitting so close, you know, I could really see all the gray and it's crazy because when I just look at myself in regular light, I don't see, I mean, I see it, but I don't see how, how much there is, you know, until I got that close. So it's gone. I fixed it. It's gone for a few more weeks at least because it'll start, it'll start again. It'll start peeping through and you know, starting again because I don't know what happened. Well, I paused you. Well, my phone paused you. So I don't know what happened. I'm gonna try again and hope for the best. So let's just get started with this order so that we can hopefully get through this video without any mistakes or mess ups or whatever. Okay, so here. It looks like a huge order, but it's a lot of bigger stuff, I think, so. Well, not a lot, but some bigger stuff. Here's the first thing. I'm just gonna put this on. Here's the first thing, and you know what? I did a, I did a bad thing. I decided 
that I was going to tell you guys my order and um, so this order was subtotal $38.62 plus $3 and something tax. I had a $10.52 price adjustment credit. So this order came to $31.47 and there are, I got three refund, three credits, um, price adjustments for $1.15. And this is, this was 363. I got this on a lightning deal, I'm pretty sure. And I think it's a lot more now. This is called an egg box. <laughs> an egg box. Hopefully this works out, because we, we have a family of seven, and we buy the big, big flats of eggs, and then we have no room in the refrigerator for them. We always have to take them out and put them in like a little bowl, like, and leave. We have a refrigerator outside, and we usually leave the big flat box, whatever, it's got a million eggs in it. Um, we usually leave that out in the refrigerator in the garage. So I got this in hopes that we could have more eggs in the kitchen at least. And I think it's upside down. No? Wait a minute. Maybe this one's just in upside down. They can't possibly go like that. Okay, well here's one. And the eggs go in there. Hold on, let me touch you guys down a little bit. The eggs go in here, right? So one, four times four is 16 eggs, which is an odd number. But then this one is upside down. Should go this way, right? But it doesn't fit that. Well, I guess it does. I lied. It fits. I think. When, I don't know. I'll have to figure it out. But anyway, I thought that would take up a lot less room than that big, that big box of eggs that, I forget how many comes in there, like 72 or something. So this one will only do, what, uh, 42, 30, 16, and 16. 42, 32, I don't know, I can't count. <laughs> anyway, I got that for 363 and it's now 903. So if you guys want something, put it in your cart, wait for the price to go down and then grab it. Okay, so that's that. these came in their own bag and I don't know what it is about I just stuck them in this big bag because it came on the same day but stickers and makeup I can understand the makeup and perfume usually are sent differently but I don't know why stickers are sent ground I don't understand that hold on I had to get the scissors sorry guys I don't understand why stickers would have to be sent that way, but they always are. Every time I get stickers for my granddaughter, they come in their own, their own thing. And they always come, is that it? Yep. Okay, so I just got her these puppy stickers. She loves stickers. Her mom hates stickers. <laughs> So I get them for her and then I just, I don't give them all to her. I just dole them out a little, a little pack, one pack at a time or whatever. And these are, oh, these are kind of like a dollies with clothes, little, little dollies with clothes. Here's Hello Kitty. These are cute. Uh, little foods. I won't show them all to you. I think there's 10. 
There's animals. Those are cute. Look at the tall giraffe. Cute. Uh, this is, oh, this is like Elsa and Anna and Elsa. Wow, that's kind of cool. She'll like that. So, emojis. Well, smiley faces, but she'll call them emojis. Ooh, numbers, hearts. I don't know what this is, a cat or something. And then more dollies to dress up. They're kind of cute and they're kind of those little puppy stickers they're not super puppy but they're they're thicker than a regular sticker anyway she'll love those i gotta hide them so that she doesn't take take them all at once and those were hold on i'll tell you those were 10 sheets um and they were a dollar 79 and they are now a dollar 69 not bad Okay. Right after I made this order, I made my first video for YouTube, for this channel, and realized that my phone that I had was not gonna work for making YouTube videos. But right after I made this order is when I went and got a new phone. So I have three phone covers in here for my old phone that are not going to work. They're cute. I don't know if you guys want to see them. They're cute. There's this one. It's kind of bumpy. It's flexible. Hot pink. I don't even know if I could give it to anybody because the only one that uses my phone now is my granddaughter for the for the games that are on there um, and nobody really wants the smallest phone and smallest iPhone this one's cute I might have to, I wonder if I can reorder this in my size this is so pretty it's bumpy like looks kind of braided kind of on and then oh the glitter it's really pretty so the hot pink one was only 86 cents this one was 224 and i believe there's one more in here i'm so bummed i mean i'm not bummed that i got a new phone because i love my new phone and i really needed it but these are really cute this one I thought I could write on there like 80s, 80s mix or 80s jams. I forget what I used to say, but I know I used to sit by the radio and wait so I could push that record button when my favorite song came on. Anyway, this one was $1.79 and they're worthless to me now. I guess I could still put them on there for my granddaughter or whatever, but it seems like a waste. I'll just donate them. I'll donate them. Okay, and then I think, is this the last item in here? The last item in this bag is a pair of sheets. Now, these are not the sheets that Material Mom got, that Hey Everybody got, that MC Beaters got, those I wanted, but the price wouldn't go down. They were $56 or something for the king size, and I do have a king bed. So one day I just happened to be browsing through, and I found this pair, and I thought, oh, those are the sheets. I thought they were the same sheets, but they're not. But these are cotton sheets. Let me tell you. They're a four-piece classic cotton fitted sheet, top sheet, and two pillowcases. Comes in a nice bag. And then there's a bag inside the bag. This zips. Ooh, I can't wait. I'm gonna wash these tonight. I 
I want to see them on my bed. These are really pretty. Oh, these are nice. These are really nice. Guess how much I paid for these? $29.31, you guys, for the whole set. And they're cotton. These are nice. Okay, let me show you the pillowcase, maybe. These are kind of... Oh, these are really pretty. They're really similar to the, the ones that everybody else was getting. They have the, sorry, they have the ties, but I think those were gingham, like a pink gingham. And this is just a solid pink. And then they're solid on this side. Whereas I think those other ones were gingham on the back side. These are really cute, you guys. These are really pretty. Look. And then look. What is that? Like a little teapot? A genie pot? Can I make a wish? Can I rub it and make a wish? What is that? It does look like I, I dream of genie. <laughs> That's what it looks like. These are really nice. They smell like cotton. They smell like cotton sheets when you can buy them. Mm, these are really nice, you guys. These are king size sheets because I got the king set. There's two. Let me see. I think, what is, wait a minute. Okay, here's the fitted sheet, right? Because it's kind of, so that's this, this pattern. Pretty sure that's the fitted sheet. Yeah. And it has the piping along the edges. God, I hope this fits on my bed. Now the thing about my bed is it's not super thick like the mattresses are these days. I might have to buy a mattress topper just to make my mattress fatter. <laughs> just to, so my sheets will fit. Because all the sheets that are made these days are really thick and my bed is not thick at all and these look really thick these are really pretty you guys if I get them if I can fit them on my bed yeah they're really here's the here it is I'm not sure how many inches that is it looks like 10 inches it's a lot maybe more let me, I have a measuring thing. Hold on, I'll get it. <laughs> okay, guys. I know this is not going to fit my bed. And so that means I'm going to have to get um, those things that go under it. Oh, wow, this is a lot more. It is... 17 inches well actually like 16 i'm going all the way to the the elastic so maybe 16 but still i know my mattress is not that not that hold on i'll tell you i'll tell you really quick <laughs> My mattress is nine and a half inches. Sorry. I know you guys don't want to see that. My mattress is only nine and a half inches, you guys. It's really cushy. It's very comfortable. But I realized when I got another um, sh fitted sheet that they make the sheets for these big mattresses now. So I don't know. I'm either going to have to get those things that that hold it at the corners, or I'm gonna have to get a big fat mattress topper to put on top of my, <laughs> to put on top of my mattress. Okay, so the last piece, I can't tell. What the heck? Okay, wait a minute. Oh, oh, this is pretty, you guys. This is really pretty. Okay, so 
the sheet, it's the top sheet itself is pink, but the the trim at the top is the pattern is the floral pattern. Wow, that's really pretty. These are really nice, you guys. I hope they wash up good and they feel like they're gonna wash up good. Mm, few strings. Oh yeah, it has like a ruffle. What? This looks like a dust ruffle. I hope this is not a dust ruffle. Wait a minute. This is weird. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. I think this is a. T I think I can use it as a top sheet. I think it's a dust ruffle. It is. That's so weird. That's so weird. Hold on. I'm going to look at the description. Let me put my glasses on. That's weird, you guys. Okay, here's the picture. Can you guys see? See that? Okay. It says, vintage floral breathable cotton bedding set. Soft and all season four piece. One flat, one fitted, and two pillowcases. Baloney. Mm. has good reviews okay okay this is I don't know if you guys can see this but this is what it looks like the top sheet is they just have it they don't have it folded under or whatever they just have it hanging out I don't know if you guys can see that very well that's so weird it literally is ruffled at the corners. Whatever. I mean, it, it's soft like, like a, oops, shut it, dang it. It's soft like a um, sheet, like a flat, like, like the sheet. <laughs> Durr. God, that's so weird though. I've never seen that. Like literally at the corners. Hold on. You can see this is a corner. It's it's pleated. Oh, it good sheets. And it's so soft. I can't wait. It's so pretty. Oh, I needed new sheets. Hope they I don't know. Probably not gonna fit. I'm gonna have to order those things now. All right, so that was that in there. It's a nice little bag to put a um, crocheted afghan or something in. I will keep that. Another one I will keep because this is pretty nice. Okay, hold on, I can't reach that other bag. Okay, here's the other bag. This has a lot of little stuff in it. Hold on, let me pull up the order, because I don't, oh, I did put prices on this one, but I still want to pull up the order for you guys, just in case. Oops. This one. I just figured out how to view the receipt. <laughs> I'm not very smart. Okay, so this order was $35.78, free shipping of course, $3 and something in tax. I had a $19.82 credit, price adjustments and returns I'm sure. So my order was $19.09, $19.09. .09. $19 and there's 11 items in this order. Okay, this is, oh, this is nail stuff. 
probably won't be able to tell what it is, but I'll open it anyway. It's um, Blooming Gel. And what it does, I'll just tell you while I'm opening it. What it does is it, you put, uh, usually put a base color down. So like maybe a white color, let's just for example. And then you would take some colored polish and um, maybe like a pink or whatever. And then you would use this blooming polish, whatever they call it and it's for gel nails and you put this on and it makes it like kind of like tie-dye out um, let me see if I can show you a picture it's called blooming gel okay let's see I'm trying to find a good picture well, see that but it kind of gives it like a tie-dye look so I thought I'd try that it was um, let's see it's a hat it's 0.51 ounces I got it for 248 and it's now 249 it's a big bottle and then I got where's the bag I got the top Top gel, top clear gel for in the same brand. And this was a dollar seventy nine, and it's still a dollar seventy nine. I am pretty sure it's the same size. Yeah, and it's the top gel, top clear coat. Okay. I, I was feeling sorry for myself this day and I I got um, some of the stone bracelets. This one is for attracting love. It was $1.98 and it's still $1.98. Just happens to be my favorite colors. Oh, it's moonstone, rose quartz, and strawberry quartz. So it's three different stones. And yeah, it's heavy, it's nice. Let's put it on. Don't mind my sweater. This is my comfy, cozy sweater I wear all the time at home. Nice, I like it. It feels so cold, like real stones. I'm pretty sure it's real. My daughter will tell me if it's not. And then I know there's another one in here somewhere. I got these. Remember the other ones I got? These are really cute. And these are, were $1.47 and they say they're sold out, but I don't know. Seems like there's always more sellers. Okay, and these are um, that kind of clip. I love these clips. They're my favorite that I use on my hair to this day, but these are for my granddaughter. <laughs> They're so cute. They look crocheted. And like I said before, I couldn't even crochet them for that. Like it would, it's a lot more work than $1.79 worth. That's for sure. All right, I'll do this later. Okay. Ooh, I got some earrings. Some costume, not, not sterling silver or anything. Oh, I just lost it back. It's okay. These were, I got them for 59 cents and they're now 69 cents. They're these, they're little rhinestones. Those are pretty. And they're just a stud. They're just a stud. Those are really pretty. I like these. 59 cents. Can't beat that. Okay, here's another bracelet. I'm falling. Sorry. Ugh. 
Okay, this one was $1.98. It says it's the Love Spell one. It's Garnet, Strawberry Quartz, Road Night, Rose Quartz, Moonstone, and Moonstone. So there's five, one, two, three, four, five, six different stones. One, two, three, four, five, six, yep. Oh, I'm so shaky. You can see the different stones. It just happens to be the pinks, my favorite color. And it says, manifest love and attraction. So we'll see. It's kind of hard to attract love when you never leave the house. <laughs> right? Right? But look at, they look pretty together. I like these. They're nice. They're really nice. Okay, what else is in here? I don't know if this is going to fit me. We'll see. It seemed cute. Seemed cute. I got a bigger size than I thought I would need because I knew it wasn't going to have any stretch. It's a sleeveless but it has a ruffle has a little ruffle around and hold on let me see if I can stand it without okay here's the is it button all the way down no okay it doesn't even button at all Michelle it has a ruffle all the way down all the way down but it's just a v-neck with a ruffle around the neck, kind of like, a, yeah, like the collar, the collar kind of stands up, which is the ruffle. And this is, for sure I got the 4X because I didn't think it would fit me otherwise. There's no stretch at all to it. It's a 4X. Anyway, I thought it would be cute with jean shorts or jeans or if I ever wear jeans again. I don't know. I did order some jeans. So those are coming. We'll see. I've never ordered jeans from Timu before. But anyway, I will, I will try this on in another video. Probably not today. And I'll show you all the stuff that I need to try on, that I got, the sheets, all that stuff. I'll show you guys. Okay. Oh, these are cute. These are cute. Got some other earrings. And I've seen other people haul these. They're pretty popular. But they're cute for Easter. They're stuck. Those are cute. Those are cute. I think they were really cheap. Oh, I got them for $1.39. They're now $1.17. But I think I've seen them even cheaper than that. They're kind of 3D. The tail is a, a separate piece. They're acrylic. They're not printed on the other side, but yet they're still, they're kind of a clear acrylic. So they're really cute. I will wear them. I will wear them for Easter. I'll wear them. They're cute. They're pink. I love pink. Okay, and that, I'm sinking again. Um, I got these just because, just because I'm thinking if I find a duvet cover, like, um, yeah, a duvet cover, uh, these are supposed to go, you put them through the duvet cover, through your comforter inside, that whatever you put inside, and then it's supposed to hold them so that that doesn't move around inside the big cover. So I got these, and they're kind of cool. These were a little more, $3.99, and they're now $4.48, and I'm sure there's a lot of sellers that have them. But anyway, they go like this. They don't go like that. They look like a, a push pin kind of thing. And then I think 
you push down. Yeah. See, it's like a big pin. Hold on. Can you guys see that? I don't know why I'm so shaky. Wow, that's big. It's not super sharp, but sharp enough to go through your... And then it goes in that piece. And then it locks down once you put it in, I'm assuming. Yeah, it locks in. So you have to release it with this little button right there. And you get, how many did I get? I think you get two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. So you get twelve of them. That's, pretty, that's not a bad deal. And they're they're heavy duty. They look nicely made, and their fabric over the the pink part is fabric. So I think those will be nice if I buy a new duvet cover. Oh, these are so cute! I need to hurry up and get these out there on the couch. We have our four pillows that we, excuse me, let me get a drink of water, sorry. Um, sorry guys, wow. Anyway, I have four pillows that we trade out for the holiday. Um, pillow covers that I've been getting from Timu. And so I got some Easter ones. These are really cute. They are that canvasy type. Oh, these are so cute. And I believe these are 16 by 16. Oh, this one's so cute. I may leave one of these in my room because it matches. They're so cute. So cute. Oh, look at this one. It's just a polka dot one. It says, be kind. It has a little chick with a heart. Yeah. Oh, that's so cute. And then they're playing on the other side. They're just, I think all of them are playing on the other side. These are nice. These are really nice. Oh, this one says, be happy. Don't worry, be happy, be happy now. <laughs> That's cute. Those are cute. And I paid, I don't know, because I lost the thing. Let me see. <sighs> my, my tablet shut off. Oh, the earrings, the, the heart earrings that were rhinestones were 59 cents. The four-piece Easter Rabbit uh, Buffalo Chuck blah, 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 pillowcases are 18 by 18 inch. Oh, my pillow, my pillows might be too small. Shoot, and they were 7.91. Well, I'll just have to buy new pillows. Um, the bracelets were a dollar ninety-eight both. The bunny drop earrings were a dollar thirty-four. The shirt was five forty seven four X and I have one more and the hair the bows clips were dollar forty seven and I think I have one more thing and that's it. Yep. I got a new um, shower curtain for my bathroom. I've been changing it. Like at Halloween, I changed it. And then I was going to get a Christmas one and I didn't. I waited too long, so I didn't get a Christmas one. So then I just put the regular one that we had, that they had when I moved in. So five years ago, almost. Yeah, five years ago. Um, it's just white. It has a pattern to it. It's really, it's a really nice one. But I washed it a couple times and the last time I washed it, well I've washed it a few times, but the last time I washed it, it's it's lined, not the plastic liner that you add, which I need a new one of those too. But the shower, the fabric shower curtain itself was lined 
and it came apart, but not at the edges, in the middle. So it looks all bunchy. I'll have to show you guys. It looks really bunchy. Anyway, so I got a new one. I went with a whole color scheme. It's pretty. It's got the grommets at the top. And, oh, it has, it's not just green leaves. It has, like, little flower buds. Kind of pink peach rust colors let me show you the picture because I'm not going to open it up all the way I won't be able to show you anyway and they have the mats that go with it god dang it Oh, the light. The light! Let me see if I can turn down the light. Uh, no, I didn't make it any better. No. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, you guys. What am I doing? Now I'm orange. Okay, whatever. You guys can kind of get the idea. It's pretty. It comes with the rings. And that was... It's only four sub... Wait a minute. No, that can't be right. That might be the mat. It is... $6.77. But it has the mats. It has the toilet seat cover. I'm not really into all that, but... Um, I paid six seventy eight, so I paid one penny more than what it is, and that is it, and that is all. I have a huge mess in here, you guys. My room is a complete disaster. Yeah, you. Ugh. I need to clean out my closet. I have so much stuff in my closet. I'm afraid I'm embarrassed to even show you guys. Oh, I'll show you really quick. It's messy. It's messy. Don't judge me. It's messy over here. I got all my stuff that I just did out here. It's messy, but if you want, I will show you um, the Lazy Susan thing I got a while back. I put it together. It's very nice. It's very nice. I recommend it. I recommend it. The three tier, there's a two tier. There's just a single tier. It's very nice. It's well made. Let me show it to you really quick. Let me see if I can flip this around. Is this the right thing? Oh God, I don't know what to do. Hold on, I'm just gonna turn you guys. Can you guys see it? There it is. Here's the top. Here's the middle one. It goes around. This is metal. It's really nice, you guys. I mean, it's not, you know, this is plastic, but it's very nice. Why can't I turn it around? I'm, I don't know. I'm not very smart. I'm not very smart. <laughs> I thought usually there's like the two arrows, you know, but on here there's just a white dot and then the red dot that means, or the red little square right now that says I'm recording. <sighs> My room is a complete disaster. Maybe I will do like material mom and video cleaning so that I hold myself responsible. You know, think that would work? <laughs> no, because I wasn't, I wouldn't be live. So I would just, I could just turn it off and not post it. Hmm, anyway, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this wasn't too much of a mess. Um, 40 minutes. I think this is only going to be like 50 minutes, maybe an hour. I have a lot to clean up. I'm going to put my sheets in the washer. Put see, I'm kind of bummed because I know they're going to be too big. I need to buy those ex those corner things for it, but I'm still going to do it. I'm still going to wash them and then 
probably put them on tomorrow and see what they look like and I'll take a picture so that I can sh at least show you guys or do a short video so that I can show you guys in my next video. I like to show you guys the stuff in action, excuse me, um, in action or tell you how it works out because a lot of times people haul stuff and then we never know what, how it worked, if it worked, what it looks like, none of that. So I like to do that for you guys. I like to do it for myself. I like to have a record of how stuff looks and I always try to put reviews, especially for the clothes. I like to put reviews up on Timu because I like to see that. I like to see people in the clothes. So I, I see somebody who's around the same size as me I know how it's gonna look on me, you know? So I like doing that. I like doing that. So that's what I'll do. I'll make sure that I take a short video and some pictures for you guys of all the clothes, of all the stuff. If I forget something, let me know. And if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. And make sure you're still subscribed because people, a lot of um, creators were saying that people were being unsubscribed in like multiple, multiple, multitudes, multiple, multiple, it's getting late. Anyway, they were being unsubscribed in bulk, if you will. So... Make sure you're still subscribed if you want to be subscribed. And I will catch you maybe with my 80s hair again. <laughs> In my 80s DeLorean as I take off through time and go back to 19... Let's see, I want to go back to 1985 or 1986 so that I can go to prom again and have fun with my boyfriend <laughs> that didn't become my husband who was supposed to become my husband but didn't no big deal it all works out all works out god makes it all work out i know that now but you know at the time you're heartbroken but i love my husband i was with my husband for almost 25 years and we we're married for almost 24 years, so he was who I was supposed to be with. Anyway, you guys, I love you. Thank you so much for helping me grow this channel so fast. I can't believe it. Thank you for all your comments. I'm still catching up on comments from the last video, the get ready with me. I think I'm caught up, but I keep going back to make sure that if anybody uh, commented on any of the other videos, I don't want to leave anybody out. I love hearing what you guys have to say. I love answering you. I love that interaction and keep it up, you guys. Thank you so much. If we get to like a thousand, I will definitely do some kind of giveaway. I don't have a lot of money, but I have a lot of Timu stuff here. <laughs> I could make a big gift box. I, I've got stuff that I haven't used. I make candles, I make soap, um, I do crafts, so who knows what you'll get. But we could do a giveaway at a thousand, I think, don't you? Wow, I love you guys. Have a good weekend if it's still the weekend for you. I'm pretty sure it is for everybody. And I will see you in my next video. Bye. I make a lot of videos, so I'm going to make sure you do it. And smash that like. And we'll see you all next time. Bye.